Okay, so um, Explorer Edition uh, version 7 just got released today for Google Glass and haven't had a much of a chance to actually play around with it, but I just want to kind of share a little bit of my first reactions to it. So, um, first thing is when you put the Screencast app on your phone, it actually brings up the screen um, on Google Glass, which to me is kind of a little annoying because it was always nice to, when people asked, oh, is that active or is that recording me? Um, to actually have it so I could bring this up and it would be a blank screen they could see that, but now it just kind of automatically turns on Google Glass. So, hopefully you can see that. Alright. Um, maybe I can find a better way of doing this in the future. Um, but yeah, for right now, it's what it is. So, um, not much has really changed with this. Um, but then, when we go to OK Glass, or to this when you actually go to look at it, you have Google, take a picture, record a video, get directions, message, call, video call. Um, this menu wasn't here before, and you can actually activate all of these by touch, which was going to be one of my suggestions, was going to be take a picture through this instead of having to press down the camera button, because it always screwed up the alignment of the pictures, but you can now do that. Um, but this is the one thing I want to show off is reddit.com hopefully there's a more elegant way of doing this but I haven't found that yet cause I just updated and threw glass on my head again so uh, but we have view website and go ahead to view it and there is the website all in my face so the way you control the website or the way you can control it is if you do two fingers um, t you can actually look at the website, so I'm going to go ahead and show you that now, but I just want to show, so just, just two fingers on the side. So, you do that, two fingers on the side, and it tracks your head movement. So as you move your head, you can scroll up and down the website. That's awesome. Um, and I believe doing that, yeah, so you can select the link. Um, so before you could not, you, before today I couldn't view any websites with Google Glass. Now, look at that, I'm viewing websites with Google Glass. So um, I'm sure there's a lot, I don't even know who you are, I'm sorry, person. Um, but yeah, that was really about the only thing that I wanted to, wanted to show. Um, I started um, swearing a little bit when I um, tried that out. I was like, oh, I can actually view a website now because that's one of my biggest complaints that I've had is I can't view a website so if I do a Google search and it doesn't bring up a knowledge graph result it's essentially useless now it's not so that's awesome um, and hopefully I can do a more in-depth overview of this update after I'm done studying for my class because I have an exam tomorrow so anyway just wanted to get this up real quick